Hi, my name is Dr. Craig Mallory. Today I'm going to be reviewing the electronic uh, torque controller which is used for dental implant and prosthetics. Um, this is a fantastic bit of kit from NSK. It's called the NSK ISD900. This is what you get. You get the motor unit, you get the, um, the charging station, the uh, torque calibrator. This is the handpiece, uh, the um, lubrication device for the handpiece and the um, uh, torque uh, calibration burr. So when you first get in the kit, obviously you're going to want to charge it, um, place it simply into the charging unit um, and then plug it into the wall and then switch this switch on here and then that will charge um, and it's very easy. Uh, when you're ready to use the unit, uh, you take off the, the dust cap um, off the head of the, which protects all the electronics inside and then um, connect the handpiece. Now I like to line up the, um, the burr um, button and the activa activation button on the motor uh, for ease of use, um, but you can put this in any uh, orientation on, on the unit depending on uh, your access for the, uh, the patient's mouth. So then start obviously by turning the, the uh, unit on, pressing the power button, and then we'll beep. Now on the display, you can see the revolutions per minute of the burr. Uh, in the handpiece, uh, the torque value and the level of um, battery life that you have. Now the torque value, this can be scaled in single units uh, all the way from uh, 10 newton centimeters all the way up to 40 newton centimeters. So this can be set, obviously as you know, all the different implant systems have their various torque values from 10 to 32 newton centimeters or, or um, so it really depends on the system but this can very accurately determine what torque value you're applying to that um, screw so to make sure that the torque value on the display is exactly what you are receiving from the the head of the handpiece um, uh, it comes with a calibration device so this is the calibration burr and this clicks into the uh, handpiece like so and then you take your, your torque uh, calibration unit uh, and have that ready. Then you press and hold the, the letter C on the motor and then it will beep twice and you'll see the, the letter L displayed and, and cal. So to, to activate the, the initial phase, you press the, this button once and it will count down from three and then the handpiece will begin to rotate. After a few seconds, it will then uh, beep again And then the letter L was replaced by the letter H. And this is for high torque. So then what you do is take the, the handpiece with the calibration unit, insert the burr into the calibration unit, like so. One press on the button and hold the handpiece and the calibration unit tight as it will begin to rotate. Once this phase is finished and it's calibrated, you'll hear a double beep. And that means it, it's been successful calibration um, and, and you're good to go. So then you can disconnect the, the calibration burr and then put in whatever prosthetic burr you have. So uh, long or short, um, they're all latch grip connections and all the implant companies do these, these such as restorative burrs. Um, so you don't need an individualized torque uh, wrench for each implant company. You just need to get the different um, the burrs. The great thing about this system is if you're restoring an implant right at the back of the mouth, you can use one of, their, uh, one of the company's short um, restorative drivers and then you can access uh, very easily the back of the mouth and apply exactly the right amount of torque that you wish to apply uh, without over torquing the implant um, or, or, or unduly stressing the patient um, because you have very easy access with this. Um, so that's that. And then when you're finished, Simply turn off the, the unit by holding the power button, disconnect the handpiece, and replace the um, protecting uh, the dust cover, uh, and then uh, you can wipe the unit down. Um, we use it with a, with a barrier across it, so um, you know, for easy cleaning. And then uh, the um, sterilization staff then can attach this to the, the motor, uh, a couple of sprays of the handpiece uh, lubrication, uh, oil and then for two seconds and then disconnect that and then that's ready for um, autoclaving.
So um, I hope that's been useful. Um, it's a fantastic bit of kit. I, I really love using it and it makes my day much easier uh, than it could otherwise be. So uh, thank you very much for listening. <laughs>